Hey, Dr. Berg here. I want to answer the question, why does insulin resistance cause weight gain? Another common question, people want to know this. Well, we have this thing called the pancreas. The pancreas makes this hormone called insulin. Insulin has a message to store fat. In the presence of insulin, you're going to make a lot of fat, okay? That's one of the functions. So what happens is the pancreas reacts to certain foods like sugar, bread, pasta, crackers, pancakes, and it starts to increasing, right? Over a period of time, the body says, no, 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 that's too much. It's rejecting it. So it starts to build up a resistance to this insulin. So it doesn't allow it to go in the cell anymore. It kind of like, pretend like it has earplugs right here. It can't hear. So what happens, all these hormones and glands are on a feedback loop, okay? So glands are the things that make hormones, and hormones are the communications that travel between. Just like right now, I'm talking to you, and I'm sending messages to you. You're hearing me, and I can't quite see you, but if you were here in, uh, in person, I would actually be able to communicate back and forth. We just have a communication cycle going on here. So what happens, we don't get a full return communication because it's blocked at the cell level, whether at the liver or at the cell level. Okay, So now, the pancreas never gets the off, off signals to turn it off. Okay, It never gets the return communication. It's kind of like talking to your child and they're ignoring you. You're going to increase your volume. So now the pancreas will go, oh, really? Okay, let's pump out more and more and more insulin Okay, because it's blocked. It's not getting through. So then maybe a little will get through. So a person with insulin resistance has five to seven times more insulin than a normal person. And that's why they gain weight because of the excess insulin, simply because this cell is uh, blocked. And the medication for diabetes, uh, especially type 2, would be called metformin. Metformin makes this receptor open up more. It helps it receive it. It actually kind of, um, kind of opens up the channel to allow this thing to feedback. But what they don't really do is correct the reason why the insulin's spiking in the first place. So you really have to correct the diet and get the person off sugar permanently and other things too, okay? All right, so I hope that helped. Thanks for watching. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. Please click the subscribe button and I will see you in the next video.